All right, so here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big kick lands. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Look at him dig that body shot right up to his opponent's third. Couple of chins here being tested early. Nice body kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Shot to the body is blocked. Another quick position. Look for a level change as he tries to secure a takedown. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, that right hand is on point. Not there. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. He's throwing every part of himself. That one appeared to stun him. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Under a minute to go in what has been a wild round one. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those legs. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Oh, he lands a straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing the strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. Trying to hammer that lead leg. All right, so there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. He's as tough as they come. He took that shot and he kept plodding forward. He got off of his butt. He got himself off of the canvas and tried to get right back to work. But he cannot take many more of these. You don't want to be the guy that's testing how tough that your chin is. Oh, no. That's a good strike right there. Big roundhouse now just misses. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fights. Oh, knee strike right to the midsection there. Nice defense there, huge block. Dig and kick. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Nice straight punch. Tie here. Powerful leg kick lands. And just misses with that big right hand. 
So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Big kick land. Throwing that jab, no good. Head kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Beautiful punch. And they clinch once again. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Try to establish that jab. Coming to the body, it's blocked. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Oh, oh. She put it to sleep. Back to the feet. Oh, straight right. Oh, and another leg kick land. Oh. Straight right, he misses. Got the single collar tie. Yet again, they will clinch here. One of the most important strikes for clinch is this big body shot. All right, let's check out some of the action DC and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper. And it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. Five minutes to go. Well, he can do oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left hook there. All right, half guard for him here and a lot of offensive options, I would think, at his disposal. Oh, he's got a ton of options. He has submission options, but I believe the safest option for him here is going to be to use his ground and pound. Build a base, posture up, broken strike. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, big left. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes. Oh! He's close. He's hurt bad. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Three minutes to go in round three. Close guard here. He's very comfortable here working off of his back, DC. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Point strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Bruce Buffer has Ladies the official and decision. Jammer, we ought to stop this contest at two minutes, 36 seconds of round number three. Playing the winner by Knockout Assassin. Oh, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what?